Let's talk about the Boston Marathon. I've been getting a lot of questions about the Boston Marathon and why my wife and I haven't ran it yet because we've made a lot of videos on it as we are trying to qualify for the Boston Marathon. I think this confusion comes from a lot of people know people who have ran the Boston Marathon and they may not be super fast. And that is because you can still run the Boston Marathon through different avenues, one of which would be fundraising. So if you fundraise for an incredible cause and raise enough money, then you get to run the Boston Marathon. So given that, they allocate a certain number of runners to qualify for the Boston Marathon by running a certain set pace and then they allow another allocation of runners for fundraising my beautiful wife's qualifying Boston Marathon time is three hours and 30 minutes my qualifying marathon time is three hours and you may be saying but your wife ran a 326 why did she not run the Boston Marathon and I ran a 258 so why did I not run the Boston Marathon well unfortunately some years so many people qualify and beat the qualifying time that then they decrease that time and not everybody gets in so I have ran four different marathons trying to qualify for the Boston Marathon and I qualified in three of those four races. Unfortunately, two of those races, so many people qualified that year, they decreased the time and I didn't make the cut. Just two days ago, I qualified again and this time I have a seven minute and 49 second buffer. Hopefully it's enough. My wife has ran about 13 marathons trying to qualify for the Boston Marathon. In one of those marathons, she ran a 326 something, but unfortunately again, that year so many people qualified, they decreased the cutoff time and she didn't make it. So will my beautiful wife and I get to run the Boston Marathon next year? This is to be determined. I have qualified. Now I just have to make sure that I make the cut. My wife will be running another marathon come September to try to qualify, meaning to break the 330 barrier. But she doesn't want to just break that. She wants to crush that, hopefully aiming between a 320 and a 325 to hopefully have a big enough buffer to get into Boston. So that's a little bit about the Boston Marathon. Let me know what you think about this whole process down in the comments.